Hey everybody, Jared back again, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at the new keyboard from Android 4.2 as well as the new camera from Android 4.2. I'll be posting a link in the description below to a couple of XDA threads for you guys to go download it. This first one here being the keyboard, if you're not rooted, you can actually download the APK and just install it using your favorite um, file manager. The second being the camera, you're going to have to be rooted, I'm sorry, that's just the way it is, but then again, more reason for you to root. So let's go ahead and get started with the stock keyboard, and as you can see, it does look just that, very, very stock. Um, but obviously, it's got some new improvements to it. Now, some people are arguing that it's been um, stolen from Swipe, that's a story for another day, uh, but for the purpose of this video, we're going to go ahead and just demonstrate some of the things. So you can type on it like you normally would, okay, and it looks very, very stock, um, but the cool part of it, obviously, if you've been following the internet is that it's got this cool little swipe feature so if I was to go like hello it already starts predicting what I want to type and um, as you start going around as soon as it predicts the word just go ahead and let go and it'll actually input that word into the text field so we could be like hello um, watch you know the smoking oh there it is smoking Android and subscribe yeah there you go so as you can see there's a bit of a demonstration you could see how it starts um, the the word comes up in big text so it's easy for you to see and then as soon as it does select your word go ahead and let go of the keyboard and away you go so that's the keyboard really cool feature I like that it'll be interesting to see in Android 4.2 especially um, any updates and patches they have to work on it um, you know we'll see if it's uh, the performance has been improved at all uh, the next one obviously like I mentioned before is the camera now you'll notice right here that we do have um, a new camera icon as opposed to the old one that being I guess the old version of jelly bean or ice cream sandwich pretty pretty standard default camera icon they've been rocking for a while so anyways um, enough about the camera icon as you can see here it is right here I'll go ahead and take it off my little stand here for you guys so you can see um, obviously you can rotate in both uh, landscape and portrait um, do we have the little uh, the little viewfinder here and it's interesting because the the um, I don't even know what you would call that but it does this little twisty thingy um, anyways, now you can go ahead and press and hold down and it comes up with a new menu, some quick settings for you. Um, swipe up to the left to get to the uh, front facing camera. You've got uh, quick access to your um, flash on and off. As you can see, swipe up to the left to turn it on, back down to turn it off and keep it in the middle for auto. And we go back there and you can go down to your settings. You can go to all kinds of other great stuff here. Um, now, I think the biggest uh, upgrade for this camera that everybody's probably watching this video for is the photosphere um, capability or function or feature if you will it does take a little bit to load up um, again this is you know this isn't exactly been like optimized and integrated because it is just a ripped APK but as soon as your device is running 4.2 I'm sure it'll be super super quick now you notice that little blue dot there and in order to start taking pictures all you do is just align it those three dots up at the top there will start going through and that's how you start the picture and as you start going around so just a quick example wait for those to happen and then you'll notice as you start moving it around the blue dot appears and you keep doing that all the way around and you can look up you can look down and really take um, a full picture uh, with this ability this definitely beats out panorama mode by far now I went to the park and went ahead and took a quick picture to kind of demonstrate um, you know how it looks after you've taken a picture and there it is the right whoops whoopsie daisy um, there it is right there and um, so I thought it did a pretty decent job it was a bit confusing because these two paths at the park here they don't look like that <laughs> this path is facing a different direction like actually out that way um, but and, and also what you'll notice while you're actually running the um, photosphere you know function um, after it's done uh, collecting all the pictures it looks very very jagged and not well put together give it some time to render you'll notice a small blue bar going across the bottom and that means that it's actually rendering and stitching together all of those little snapshots to make one big picture and as you can see here it did a really fantastic job stitching them together with the exception of a couple of small areas which whoops 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 which I'll point out right now um, that being one of them there's no cut there um, as you can see there's a you know some some cutting there going on um, but really still very great and the software is obviously um, producing really high quality images 
So I was really quite impressed with it. Um, I'm sure again, once uh, your device has been updated to 4.2 or if you you know download a ROM that's 4.2 uh, based, then this will probably work perfectly. Um, but anyways, there's a quick look at the two new applications. I hope you like it. Like I mentioned before, I'll be posting a link in the description below for you guys to go download it. A uh, root is not necessarily needed for the keyboard, but if you do want the camera, it is needed. I'm sorry. Um, but that's it for now, guys. Thanks again for watching. If you like the video, shoot me some love by hitting that likes button down below. It does tell me that you do like these types of videos uh, as opposed to others, I suppose. And you may want to consider subscribing for more videos like this in the future. <clears throat> we do have videos five days a week. All right, guys, that's it for now. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks again for watching. Cheers.